Time for a new unit breakdown video. This time we will learn all about the Cannoneer. The Cannoneer is a rare range support unit with a pretty cool attack. It belongs to the Chaos faction and has immunity against physical forces. The Cannoneer shoots huge cannonballs that deal damage on impact and pushes back enemy units. After the ball stops rolling, it explodes, dealing additional AoE damage. Interestingly, the ball deals triple damage against static units. More about that later. The Cannoneer is a support unit by nature and should be protected, but as the range of its attack is not that great, placement can be tricky. A popular option is to place it right behind the frontline melee units or in some fortification setup. Thorn Guards are a good option to place in front of the Cannoneer, as their movement speeds are similar and therefore stay together. Barrier Monk and Spirit Shield Generator of course go well together with the Cannoneer, as they provide much needed protection from ranged attacks. The triple damage against static units means that the Cannoneer is extremely effective against Spires and Soul Pylon. Often the shot cannonball goes through the enemy front line, ending up mid-battlefield where enemy spires and pylons usually are. More often than not, a single hit is enough to destroy a spire or two. With this in mind, it might not be wise to use Ancient Tree together with the Cannoneer, as enemy units tied down by the roots stop the cannonball at them, losing the chance for the cannonballs to go deep into the enemy's side. There are multiple good Power Stone options for the Cannoneer, Reload being among the best as the Cannoneer has a relatively long attack cooldown. Range and aim are obviously beneficial, as well as many offensive power stones like Damage and Ignite. Standard of the Ancient Defender artifact gives a nice boost to the Cannoneer's range. Great Hammer of the Shattered Mountain, on the other hand, boosts the Cannonball Explosion area and damage. If you have a lot of other Chaos units in your setup, Skull of the Necromancer is probably the best option from the rare artifacts. Alrighty, that was the Cannoneer. Comment below which unit you would like to see next. And as always, give us a like and join the community at our Discord server. See you next time.